So before um, before I start this vlog, I want you guys to look at my view.
cooking in the truck. Gonna make some eggs and wieners. <laughs> Got the kessel going, eggs, and some wieners. <laughs> now nah, it looks good though. It smells good in here. Gonna eat like a king in front of my view. <laughs> good morning, everybody. Good morning. Um, so, change of plans on my way to uh, Oregon. I was in Crescent City last night, stayed there, beautiful, stayed on the ocean, I forgot what it felt like to be cold, <laughs> it got a little cold last night, had to actually use my blankie, uh, now I'm on my way to Oregon, I didn't realize, ooh, that's a big bug, uh, Crescent City was so close to Oregon, the Oregon border, so it's got so I passed the sign it was like seven miles to Oregon. Um, so for Crescent City it's gotta be like maybe 13. You know, maybe maybe 10. So on my way after that, Nevada headbound. Harbor. It's right by the harbor. 
very, very, uh, very, very charming. Very charming. Oh, look at that. Oh, okay, wait till mine's done. Um, yeah, very charming place. Very nice. little shops, little eateries. Very nice.
army. up and make sure that you know um, I get it on there and get it on the truck properly 
Uh, it just the way it was dropped. I didn't. I really didn't like that. So I took pictures of it and I sent it to my boss, just letting them know, like, hey, you know, they're dropping loaded trailers like this, kind of crooked. You know, so anything happens and they fall over, it ain't my fault. But uh, but anyway, so yeah, so on my way out of here, uh, probably won't. I probably won't be able to leave Oregon. But I'll get as far as I can, so I have to stop at a truck stop somewhere. Cause I'm running low on hours. So I'm at a truck stop. all these trucks hey good morning everyone uh, had to stay here at the truck stop oh last night I gotta check out the truck before I leave oh. 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 Um, so that's what I'm gonna do oh. Check everything out. I get out uh, pretty slow because <laughs> uh, I don't want to fall. So I'll go ahead and. Gosh damn, man. You know, I'm trying not to cuss here. Sometimes that's. Easier said than done. But I am still in Oregon. So, um, I already went to go wash up and had to comb the beard. I don't take care of it like I should, but I try to take care of it as much as I can. Um, Niners are playing today. Uh, we're gonna win. It's, yeah, very simple. Very simple game. Uh, we are playing. Who are we playing? Buffalo? Something like that. Nah, something weird. I get my. I get my hood up. Come on, get over here. Hood going. I check out my stuff. My what do you call it? Holum? Holum? It moves on its own. I think it's trying to find me. But I always wear gloves when I do my little pre trips here. Basically, I'm just checking everything out. Sure, I have oil because I'm gonna be going up, uphill and downhill. Yeah, we got plenty of oil. Plenty of oil. Um, make sure all my hoses are good. Nothing's leaking. Which I'm pretty sure that hose is gonna be ready to go soon. Fun stuff. So, let me go look at the other side. Okay. Let's see. Switch you guys over here. There we go. Just looking for leaks, anything out of the ordinary, cracks, lumps, bumps. <laughs> uh, yeah, anything out of the ordinary. I mean, my man, he's old, but 
you know, he's still going, so. pretty good. Let's see, how can I correct that? Let me see. So that it stops moving. Let's try that. Is it still moving? A little bit. Not as bad. I'm going to go dump my tires. So I make sure everything is still on. Dun, dun. Make sure my airbags aren't blown. Anything like that. good anyway let me tell you though it was sound good look good um it was nice and cold last night <laughs> it reminded me I was telling my wife that uh it reminded me how cold it gets in the truck I haven't I haven't felt that kind of cold in a while. <laughs> so it's like, uh-oh. Um, but a little, uh, about a few minutes ago, I just received news um, of uh, a friend of ours that we used to work with, me and my wife. Um, oh, that guy's got a little puppy. <laughs> um, and uh, he just lost his dad, uh, I guess, this morning. So, you know, obviously I feel really, really bad. So does my wife because I just lost my dad. So I feel for him completely, you know. I know exactly what he's going through. I know what he's feeling. Um, he's been having to take care of his dad off and on for, it's been, it's been quite some time. Um. And it's been like, I want to say it's been a few years since the last I heard that um, he had been taking care of his pop, you know, and I just feel really bad for him. You know, it's, it's not an easy thing to deal with. Um, so I feel really bad for him, you know, um, but... Fortunately, it's life. Yeah. It's just life. The hardest part. <laughs> the hardest part in life. So. Yeah, it's just. It's awful. But, Chris, I feel bad for you, brother. Hopefully. You know. You find peace too. It's hard, but he'll 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 get through it. He'll get through it. We all have to keep going. As painful as it is, we all have to keep going. As you can see, I'm still at the truck stop. <laughs> the guy has a little puppy. Uh, sitting on his lap. <laughs> Cute. <laughs> anyway, let me get back in this truck. Ah, this is not safe, doing it one-handed. Oh, oh, it smells good in here. It smells like, you guessed it, eggs and wieners. <laughs> Uh, it's too funny. <laughs> but anyway, um, I got to get my butt on the road. This load doesn't deliver till 9. It is... What time is it? 11.44. Yeah, so... Uh, 
got to do that got to make that happen deliver this load and i'll be staying there tonight last time i went over there um it's a dfa facility uh uh dairy farmers of america well um let me tell you <laughs> it wasn't a good idea to get there early that's why i'm leaving so late got a couple of winks you know um because uh it i didn't get i i think i got there like around six last time something like that and i didn't get out of there till like two in the morning just to park on the side of the road and finish my rest go to sleep you know it was it was awful that place is you know they they reserved one door there's two doors but they reserved one door for all the milk that they were taking and then the other door was whenever a driver would show up that had a different form of milk it was like man you need to wash those pipes you know and and get all these drivers out of here in and out whether they're just you know pump and go whether they're pump and wash get them in get them out and then those other guys they can wait you know because we're all sitting there um yeah i've i really you know would have liked to have shot that guy but anyway hopefully it's not like like that but it's okay because i get paid just for sitting there and i'm i'm happy and proud of that <laughs> but anyway um all right so I'll be on my way, get a little bit of footage. Peace out, guys. Well, got here to um, my point of destination here. And um, here in Fallon, Nevada. And I just watched the my Niners score another point. <laughs> so now it's 30 to 12. <laughs> Yeah, it's easy work. It's easy work. Um, but no, it's it's awesome. But anyway, I'm just gonna shut down here, stay here the night. I'm gonna eat my burger and wait till it get pumped out and washed out, and then uh, take my tin and see you guys in the morning. Scratching on it and it prevents scratches from showing up in your future. The company comes up with a brand new with scratching and you don't have to worry about seeing scratches every time you drive, which is just. Thank you.